What is up everybody? We are doing a deck profile here for a, a Master Rule 5 <coughs> deck. So, new Master Rule, new format kicks in. Uh, sadly, my all my locals are closed due to the current um, situation in the world. But still working on decks, still testing, so let's get into it. This is update hero deck. Uh, hand traps, we play 3 Ash. Um, three impermanence. Finally, after two years of this card being out, I finally got my hand on a playset. So, anyways, uh, permanence like effect failure, but you can also set it to activate it on your permanence turn. Uh, ash is ash. That really hasn't changed. Uh, I don't play cold by the grave anymore. Even though in theory I could probably cut uh, an ash and imperm for two called by just for safety. But instead, I think I'm just going to keep it this way. Three Shadows searches out majority of the deck. Uh, two Shadow Mist searches out Mass Change. Uh, one Solid summons out. Um, normally, I want to summon out either Shadow or Stratos in order to get the search of either Mass Change or Hero. Uh, one Liquid because you only really need to play one. You, you can play two if you want, but I prefer one. Um, fusion it off, draw two cards, discard a card. Uh, just like with Solid, if it's normal summoned, you can special summon a hero from your grave, level 4 or lower. Uh, lastly, for the elemental hero part, one Anasinos. You don't really need to play more than one. I suppose you could, but this is a 40 card list. You'd probably play more than one if you're playing like 60 cards. Anasinos, uh, for battle tricks. For the vision heroes, this hasn't changed at all. You still play 3 Ferris, 2 Increase, and 2 Vion. This part hasn't changed because there's not really a need to change it. Um, search up polarization. Ferris discard a hero to summon him out. Uh, Ferris will put increase in spell trap zone. He'll use increase to pop the Ferris. Do summon increase to summon out the Vion from your deck. Vion will dump a hero from your deck to grave. Banish a hero to add poly. Um, so yeah, this part hasn't changed at all. Neither has the uh, I want to hear a lineup. Sadly, the balance took a Mali, so we played two Mali. Uh, I missed, the, in testing, I missed three Mali so much. Just having that third Mali for another extend, for extending the plays. Um, but it is what it is. Nothing we can do about that. Uh, one Celestial dump for Fusion Destiny, because I still play Fusion Destiny. For a 1600, uh, 1600 burn, plus the draw facts if it comes up. Uh, Dino Tag for more battle tricks. Uh, going... First, Plasma, a Walking Skill Drain, so that part hasn't really changed. At least I do miss playing 3 Mali. I miss it so much. Uh, lastly, for the Monsters, one Adjusted Gold, because I have it. Um, some build, If you have Adjusted Gold and Bane, play it. If you don't have them, it's fine, but I uh, would rather play the Gold and Bane as another OTK route. For the spells, three E-Calls, searched out majority of the deck. Just like Stratos. Uh, three mass change, because this is Heroes. Three Fusion Destiny, Arch Doll Fusion of the deck. Um, use it somehow Dystopia for the most part. Then using Dystopia to burn for 1600. Mass change, going to Dark Law, plus like Anki, plus Blast, plus Acid. Lastly, for the spells. One hero lives. I'm honestly thinking about cutting this because I don't like paying uh, half my life bonus. Probably cutting it for like a monster reborn, if I'm going to be completely honest. Uh, one polymerization, one miracle fusion, and one dark calling to finish out the fusion spells. Uh, the only trap I play is Impermanences, Imperm, which is also a hand trap, so that's why it's out there. For the extra deck, two Cross Crusaders, cause, and two Cross Crusaders, one Runner Driver, and one Dread Dominator. This part doesn't really have to change. Uh, I am thinking about dropping a Cross Crusader for a, another Fusion Monster um, and keeping it to the simple three lineup, but I haven't decided which one I want to go with, and so I'm still testing that out. Uh, Dread is still very, very, very good, saving across, and Wonder Driver still has use of this with resetting your mass changes. Um, Dread, being the Link 3 of the deck, is very easy to go into, plus also for more R2K boosts, plus also combat tricks with things such as Dystopia being able to pop cards on an almost existent basis because with Dystopia's effects, it will also um, go down to its original attack, 
but then also, but then the Dread Dominator will also make it go up during the next turn. Uh, cross will simply unless you revive the Destiny Hero, tribute the Destiny Hero, search for a hero. Two Dark Laws, because Dark Law is a very good card still. Uh, one Anki, probably could drop this for something else. I haven't decided what yet. Everything's still up in the air with this build. Uh, one Blast to get rid of the Floodgates. Acid and the Ab Zero as part of the Liquid Package. Uh, being able to match change Acid away into Acid to get rid of both monsters and spell in uh, the back row. Fantastic. Very easy to do in this deck. Uh, one Sunrise. Very easy to summon the Sunrise. All you need is two heroes with different attributes. For the most part, I like using, if I can, Solid Soldier and Liquid. Rearranging the Chainlinks to be uh, Chainlink 3 being Sunrise, Chainlink 2 being Liquid, Chainlink 1 being Solid in order to revive a hero and getting his effect off without missing timing, such as Stratos. So that's it for that part. Uh, one Dangerous to send uh, a Destiny hero and Shadow Mist, really. Shadow Mist lets me search out a hero. Uh, Dystopia, just to, for A, the popping effect, but B, the burn effect. The burn effect is so important because it lets you OTK a little faster and also lets you, uh, when it comes to game three and the time rules of how it works, the burn comes into play to get that advantage. Uh, one Malicious Bane, OTK, simple. Uh, field clear, and if need be, if they have Mystic Mine and plus, let's say, one monster. A Visionary of Trinity. Uh, I have yet to go into I haven't gone into this card in so long, but it's there as a option. So that is it for the hero deck profile for uh, Master Level 5 and this new format. Uh, sadly, like I said, my locals are closed. I was really looking forward to uh, capturing some gameplay at my locals during this uh, what was going to be one of the most crazy times to play this game just because of how the rules are now back to what they were and also um dual overload is now available in stores it was going to be a fun format but sadly world events says otherwise and thus uh, my locals are closed so i want to thank you guys for watching this video and i'll see you guys in the next one